it's Halloween season. I, I don't know. The other people say it is. I don't know how that happens. I don't know what day delineates Halloween season. I, do, I don't know. I'm just trying to work with the fucking algorithm. Hi guys, my name is Grace Helbig. If you did not know, now you know your life is different now. <laughs> <laughs> it's Halloween season, which means pumpkins. Again, I don't know the math on that. I went to Michael's Crafts today and I bought a bunch of plastic pumpkins because they're easier to work with and they were 50% off. So I don't know if that is something that helps you in your life. With these plastic pumpkins, I'm gonna show you three different, extremely terrifying decorative ways you can decorate your pumpkins. I haven't thought this sentence through. Let's get started. He did the monster match. The monster match. It was a graveyard. For this first pumpkin, I totally forgot to talk through what I was doing, so I just used painter's tape and I taped it and then I painted it, so. There's a brush hair on this motherfucker. I'm gonna put our painted pumpkin outside to see if it will dry quicker and move on to other pumpkins. Emojis are a very popular Halloween costume. They have been over the last couple years, and I thought it'd be fun to make an emoji pumpkin. I'm gonna take this tiny pumpkin and make it into an emoji. That terrifies me. Let me know if you guys can figure out which one it is while I make it. First thing I'm gonna do is take this yellow paint, and I'm gonna paint this stem yellow. Okay, next, we need our glue gun. I should have plugged this in way earlier. While our glue gun heats up, we're gonna add on to this pumpkin. I'm gonna take the black Sharpie. Yeah, draw out some of the defining features. Great, meanwhile, I'm gonna draw a couple other features using other Sharpies. Cool. Now I'm gonna use my glue gun, which is warmed up, and I'm going to take googly eyes I have and attach them. I get no doubt, I get and then I need to, to match the pumpkin, I'm going to cut out some shapes to add onto the side that I think will add to the overall effect of this emoji. Okay, uh, uh. then I'm gonna hot glue my pieces onto our pumpkin. This will be revealed at the end. We're moving on to the next pumpkin. In my own panic of not wanting this pumpkin to unintentionally look like a piece of shit, I decided to add some color to it. So this last one, I wanted to do this way. So I wanted to lay flat on its side. And these are plastic pumpkins bought from Michaels. So I'm gonna try and cut the bottom of it open so it sits flat. I have some tiny X-Acto knives. Oh, I also, I used an orange Sharpie marker and I colored the stem a little bit. Um, okay. Ugh. Okay, this is not the right tool. Oh my god, this is the force. Haha, -ha, wow, we did it. So for this one, I'm turning it on its side using this as the face, and I'm gonna draw on it a little bit and turn it into the thing that scares me the most. I took this moss and I tried to spray paint it gold and it didn't really work out, but that's okay. We're gonna hot glue some moss onto the top of this because why not? Barbie, let's go party. I'm, I'm gonna doctor this up a little bit. I'll show you this one at the end. Let me go back to our first pumpkin now. Okay, this is definitely not dry. It's been like a half hour, but let's try to bring our hair dryer in and expedite the process. That's fine enough. Okay, haha, <laughs> good enough. Now we're gonna take the tape off and do other things to this. Oh, it's still not terrible. Kind of bad, but like in a cute way. Oh, not the worst, not the best. Solid, mediocre performance. On the other pumpkins, I wanted to show you how you could make characters or emojis, or you could draw whatever you want on them. On this one, I want to show you that you can make just a cute geometric design that's like super half-assed. But then you can amp this up by creating a message on the design. I bought a bunch of different letter stickers at Michael's, which are great, and they give you the freedom to write whatever you would like on your pumpkin. The scariest sentence or phrase or words that you could ever imagine can now become a reality on your pumpkin. Do it. 
Oh, cute! And there you go. There is my f***ing terrifying Halloween pumpkin decorative tutorial. I hope that this was helpful in any way. Let me know which pumpkin you are the most afraid of in the comments down below. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel because I like it when you do. That's it. I don't know. Oh no! No! I dropped it on the ground and it rolled straight across my rug and all my clothes! I've stopped being polite and I'm starting to get real. I dropped this damn pumpkin, it rolled onto all these clothes, and it rolled straight across and it landed here. Fuck you motherfucker. Ow, 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 Crafts!